All right, I hope all is well on your end. Now I have opened up Cricut Design Space. I have my blank canvas. And the first thing I'm gonna do is go over to the upload tab. I'm gonna click here to upload an image. I'm gonna look for the file where um, I have saved my chip bag template. All right, now that my template is uploaded, I'm just gonna click comp complex. I'm gonna save it as a print then cut image. All right, now that my template is uploaded, I'm going to click on it right here and insert it. It may take a few seconds for it to upload. now it's uploaded completely so it does take a few seconds for the file to upload once it's fully uploaded you will see it here it's too large for you to see so i want to make it change it up so the width should be 11 and the height is 8.5 Okay. So this is a full size um, image that you need. If you if you want to do a print and cut in Cricut, you're going to have to adjust the size and make it 6.75 by 9.25. That means your bags are going to be smaller but you can use it as a full size image you would um, have to use your snipping tool on your computer if you go down to your search tab after you finish your design if you go down to your search tab you can pull up your snipping tool and you can And so that way you can um, print out the full size design if you're going to be working in Cricut Design Space. So now that your template is uploaded, you can go ahead and upload everything else like your nutritional facts and your barcode. Let me do that. All right, guys, so from here, you can start designing. You can upload all of your images that you want to use, any backgrounds you want to use, and you can start designing. So if you still have questions, please um, email me at latoya at hangingwiththekiddos.com, or you can drop me a comment down in this video. Thanks so much for watching, and see you next time. Bye.